common intracranial aneurysm. Notice the abnormal widening or dilation of the blood vessel. Most aneurysms are treated through open surgical procedures by placing metal clips across the neck of the aneurysm. In addition to the risks associated with an open craniotomy, there is potential for the clip to migrate off the neck of the aneurysm. This often creates regrowth of the aneurysm and in turn may require retreatment. Embolization using balloons, stents, and coils has emerged as a minimally invasive alternative to surgical clipping. Many of these methods are difficult to control in terms of product placement. The embolizing agent may migrate outside of the treatment area, potentially causing regrowth of the aneurysm. This potential migration may also cause rupture. Our liquid embolization process using Neurocryl A redirects blood flow dynamics, reconfiguring the blood vessel lumen, which eliminates the debilitating pressure on the aneurysm. The minimally invasive technique used for delivering Neurocryl A in treating an aneurysm is similar to the delivery of Neurocryl M in treating an AVM. With the addition of a balloon catheter, which is placed at the neck of the aneurysm and inflated prior to product delivery. Once the balloon is in place, the clinician positions the tip of the microcatheter at the center of the aneurysm and injects the mixture. This liquid polymerizes on contact with the blood, filling the aneurysm and isolating blood flow to the diseased area. The ultimate goal for Neurocryl A is to promote the regrowth of a healthy blood vessel lumen wall. The balloon catheter prevents the product from migrating during polymerization and assists in remolding the vascular structure. After product delivery, the balloon catheter is deflated and removed along with the microcatheter. 